liquid liquid extraction is a very important step to reduce or to fractionate uh, some uh, groups of compounds uh, uh, we follow the polarity well here we have we prepared the aqueous layer this is the aqueous layer it is constituted from uh, we have methanol then and also water about 30% of water and 70% of ethanol uh, in fact we've already prepared the uh, this is a crude extract basically so the crude extract was prepared from um, by methanol as an extractor agent then we dissolve the methanol in 30 person in 70 person um, so the crude extract methanol like crude extract we dissolve it in 70 person methanol and 30 person uh, water so why we add the water in fact to create the aqueous layer because we will add some hexane i'll add the hexane here then I'll add the, the, the chloroform, the ethyl acetate, and try to make some fractionation. As I said, to, um, uh, we will follow the heliotropic series uh, in order to reduce uh, the complexity of mixture. Because when we talk about a crude extract, we have hundreds of molecules and we need to isolate them. It is very hard to isolate them, so we, uh, there are a lot of steps that we need to uh, proceed to get a good separation. Right now, I'll add hexane. So you will uh, realize the creation of two uh, different layer here and I didn't shake yet but uh, you will see how it uh, works well okay yes like that uh, here we have two layers so the top one is the organic and uh, the down uh, part is the down fraction is the aqueous layer uh, uh, let's just uh, if we didn't add the water here and the methanolic extract we took the methanolic extract and we dissolved it in methanol and then we added the hexane so they will be mixed together we will not have two faces okay and in order to have two different phases, it is very important to add the water to increase the, the, the density of this fraction to be down. Then we, when we will add uh, any fraction, they will be uh, not together. We didn't shake yet, but we have to shake to shake very, very well in order to have uh, to increase the surface the surface of contact between the organic and the aqueous layer we use the stopper this is the stopper we have to uh, close the separatory panel this is it we close it then we reverse inverse Separate your panel like that. We shake. We open the top to decrease because we have some gases heat uh, and produce it inside the separatory panel. We shake. We open the Then another time. And we open. Now we, we close the top and we put and then we open, we remove the stopper. So this is the surface of contact between the two organic layers.
and here we go.